right, guys, it's me, Butterfly Spirit. So what I wanted to do, guys, is I am going to share some information with you um, about a reading that I just did. Um, and the reading is about a coworker of mine. And um, there was a circumstance at work today, and um, it kind of left me a little bit puzzled about my coworker. Um, and I was trying to, you know, figure out in the grand scheme of things about like, you know, what's going on, you know, with her, you know, um, and I just got curious. So I decided to do a tarot reading and, um, I did do a reading. So, um, these are the cards I used. So this is my Rider Waite tarot card deck, um, that I have. And, um, I ended up pulling two cards from my Rider Waite deck. And the two cards that I pulled, so uh, my Rider Waite deck, so I'll show you guys what the cards look like. So these are my Rider Waite uh, tarot cards here. Um, and for the tarot cards that I have, I mean, here, there you go. I'm going to turn it this way. So for the tarot cards that I have, there are um, 78 different uh, tarot cards in this deck. Okay. So, um, so basically you know whenever i get a feeling sometimes i'll do a reading um it could be about you know anything anybody any circumstance or whatever just whenever i get a feeling to do a reading um and interestingly enough a lot of times the readings i do actually happen to be very spot on um so um i did a reading today about a co-worker of mine and i pulled two cards that stood out to me in my tarot card deck um and i'm going to share those two cards with you so the two cards i pulled um that relate to uh, my co-worker in particular um the cards i pulled is um the hierophant so i don't know if you can see i'm gonna try to pull it back so the card i pulled Oh man, it's so hard for it to focus. So the card I pulled is, oh, is that, hold on. There, I guess you guys can see it. It's like my camera's trying to focus. Let's see if I can, is this over there? Nah. Okay, maybe not. <laughs> so anyway, the card I pulled uh, for my coworker is the Hierophant um, and the Four of Cups, okay? So um, it's easier to see it on this side. See if I can do it on the side. Uh, oh, no. <laughs> I'm trying to, trying to pull it over here. I don't know why my camera is inverted for some reason. It's weird because right here it's like switched over. But anyway, the Hierophant and the, um, the Four of Cups are the cards that I pulled. So this is the, the Four of Cups. And then here is the Hierophant card. My camera seriously inverted. I got to check on the settings. Anyway, um, so these are the cards that I pulled. And you guys may be wondering what do these cards mean? So when I pulled these two cards here for uh, my coworker, then um, what I found was that these cards were not upright. Um, in fact, the cards were reversed, okay? And when a card is reversed, that means the card has the opposite meaning, in my opinion, anyway. So um, what does this mean when it comes to my coworker? Because many of you who are watching, you may be like, well, you know, um, what's the what's the deal you know so um when it comes to the hierophant um i went basically um the hierophant so basically i went by what i was feeling from this card not necessarily like um what the meanings that other people have given but i went by what i was feeling coming from the card so here we see the hierophant right and there's two guys coming to the hierophant um, and they're coming to him for advice. Okay. In my opinion, uh, in this certain context and, um, you know, this could be like anybody, you know, going to, 
uh, a guru or a spiritual leader of some type to get advice on something, you know, so that they can, um, you know, learn from the spiritual leader and maybe even, you know, somebody may come to a spiritual leader uh, or person who has a lot of wisdom to get advice on a circumstance or situation that's going on in their lives. Okay. In the context of my coworker, um, there is somebody who, um, and it was reversed, but, um, there is somebody who, um, there we go. So there's somebody and it, it was reversed. So basically, um, my coworker went to somebody to get advice, okay? And she received wisdom from someone. I don't know who it is, okay? And from the person who she went to to get advice from, you know, she probably had a problem or circumstance or something like that. She went to a person to uh, ask, you know, what she should do, okay? And, um, you know, if, you know, if the information was received by her, you know, and she accepted it and started to use it and apply it, the card, in my opinion, would be upright. However, when I pulled the card, it was reversed. So what this means to me, in my opinion, just from what I feel, is that someone gave her advice on a situation Okay, and what she did is that she received the wisdom, but basically she decided not to use it. And instead she wanted to go with how she wanted to do things. So she kind of did one of those, yes, this is fine, but I think I know better than you type of thing, okay? And so, because she received the wisdom, I mean, she still has the ability to use the wisdom she was given by whoever. But the Five of Cups, in my opinion, is going to show what the outcome is going to be of her not heeding the wisdom and using the wisdom or the advice that she was given by someone she went to for help. Okay. So, um, Five of Cups, okay? So here we have a young man, okay? And he's sitting down and in my opinion, the universe is bringing him an opportunity. So the universe is bringing him something, you know, maybe something like a good opportunity, you know, in life. It could be a new job, it could be a business idea, it could be, you know, a way to improve and make you know, his life better, okay? So the young man is getting some type of thing from the universe, something that can maybe make things better for him in some shape or form, okay? My opinion, my feelings, okay? So in this situation, um, take my, move my fingers back. Um, the young man has options. So um, although the young man has options, the universe decides to bring a better option than the other options that are, you know, right here in the front, better than these three options. However, the young man just kind of sits under the tree, shaking his head like, I'm not listening, right? So <clears throat> as far as my coworker is concerned and what I feel is that um, oops, in this situation, my camera's trying to focus. <laughs> The card was reversed. So what exactly does this mean when it comes to my coworker? Well, what it means is, is that um, we talked about the fact that she received some wisdom from somebody on something she's trying to do, okay? She received some advice that can help her to maybe handle a situation that she's going through, right? And that wisdom is there and it was presented to help her. But since the Hierophant was reversed, she refused to listen to the wisdom. So in this situation, what does that mean and why is this card reversed? Well, the Four of Cups is reversed in the situation with her because what this means is, is that it means that that opportunity that my coworker was presented with 
by the universe. The universe gave her a golden opportunity for something. And what's going to happen as far as what I feel is that that golden opportunity the universe gave her is going to be taken away along with the wisdom that she received. And she may not notice it at first, but it's going to disappear. And it's it's the best option for right now and it's something that can really, really help her. But she refused to listen to the wisdom, so therefore that opportunity is going to go away. Now, you guys may be saying, well, so what's going to happen to the other options? Well, once that good opportunity that the universe wants to give her goes away, then she's going to be left with those other options. And one by one, those options are going to disappear. So then she's not going to have any options. Okay? And so the thing is, and what we can learn from this particular reading is, is that whenever, you know, and this is just for anybody, whenever you get wisdom from somebody and it is something that is going to improve your life in some way, okay? Hierophant, whenever you get wisdom, you go to somebody to get wisdom, okay? Whenever you do that and somebody gives you some insight and it might be something that could be new to you, something you've never heard before, something that might, you know, contradict everything you, you feel is against you. Take heed to that wisdom and listen because that wisdom can be something that can help to propel you forward in life. And it may even get you out of your comfort zone, but it might be right for you because that person gave you wisdom they may not, you know, they could be anybody, you know, in your life. But if it's somebody who gives you wisdom, take it in, listen, and think about it and, you know, say, hmm, could I apply this information in my life? Is it something that can help me? Right? Right? So, you know, that's kind of what we get from the higher fan. That's what I feel is coming from the higher fan. Along with wisdom, we can be presented with opportunities. And the universe will give us an opportunity. And sometimes it's something we've been wanting to happen. Something we really wanted to happen. And sometimes when we have something we really wanted to happen, or we have something coming in, it's a good idea to receive that good opportunity. Don't take it for granted. Receive it you know, along with the wisdom to have a better life experience, okay? Even if you feel like, hmm, I have, you know, I have so many things to choose from, the universe may show up with an option that may not necessarily be something you're thinking you want, or it may not be something that you think that you're ready for, but it's something that can really enrich you and help you, okay? Even if what may be presented in front of you may seem great, the other option that may, you know, you may think is like, hmm, that's not something I would choose, could be the right option for you. And a lot of times when the universe speaks, a lot of times you will hear things repeated to you. And it'll happen more than once and you'll hear the mention of something, okay? And that'll be your sign to go for something. Now for my coworker, Unfortunately for her, right, she was reversed. So that means that she's going to lose a good opportunity. And then one by one, those other opportunities are going to go. And those other opportunities that may be in front of her that she thinks are good are going to go away too, along with the wisdom. Okay. So um, what does this mean for her? Well, um, I think it means that she's going to have to start over. Um, I think that there's something in her life that she's going through. She received wisdom from somebody. Somebody gave her some really good advice. She took, she's choosing not to listen. She still has the opportunity to listen, but she's choosing not to right now. And because she's choosing not to listen right now, it's going to result in her losing opportunities. And yes, at some point in the future, she's going to be able to maybe build herself back up in the future. But for right now, 
because she's refusing wisdom, she's going to lose opportunities, which sucks. So anyway, guys, thank you so much for um, listening to uh, watching my video. Um, and I hope this, this is helpful. Um, for those of you who are out there, I am learning a lot about um, the tarot cards and things like that. Um, however, you know, um, in this particular reading, I decided I wanted to go a little bit more intuitive and kind of just see how I felt and, you know, what, what kind of message was coming to me, uh, based off the course I received. And so that's the reading. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope it's been informative. Bye.